I consider myself an artist, sculptor, and photographer. I remember it was on my birthday. A friend had invited me to go uh, to go to the beach, and we walked through Jericho Park. And I thought, wow, this is beautiful, the trees. And so this was the first time, I think, that I uh, discovered uh, Jericho Park. What, in, what inspires me the most through the seasons? I would say the changes that are happening through the seasons. In the springtime, you can smell something fresh, something, uh, the leaves are coming out. The, the, and then through the summer, the, 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 the spring, the, the flowers and all of this. And through the fall, the leaves, I consider it almost like a cathedral, you know, a big space with the trees and it's, uh, there's no noise really other than natural noise. Uh, I could just imagine a symphony. So all of this uh, to me is, uh, is part of the changes that are happening in nature. So that's, it's very inspirational because like I said, what I see happening around me in the environment is helping me to understand what's happening within me as well. There's one in particular that I've uh, learned to uh, interact with. When I come walking towards the wetlands, the ponds, where the nests are, uh, she will recognize me from uh, quite a big distance. I just put my hand like that and she comes in a straight line and she applies the brake. She opens her wings so that she can land on the tip of my fingers very gently. And as she looks at me like very happy and I look at her, it's, and we have, she knows me like I can actually bring my hand just close like that and to be able to, to look at her. These moments of discovery that is accessible to anyone are there. It's just that we have to take the time to discover them. It brings us closer to nature. It's healing to see this beauty. And, uh, and then you could go back to the lifestyle you have and you bring these moments of beauty with you. I really believe that the environment has an effect on general health. If I was to wake up one morning and I couldn't see uh, the park or the, the trees and all of this, I would be sad. I would, oh, I would have to replace it with something similar.